Hello, today I will be showing you how to use the 4 relay module from Songo. So that way you can control a water pump using an Arduino Uno. First, let's go over what all the pins are used for. This pin is the ground pin. You're going to want to plug that into your Arduino ground. These four pins labeled IN1, IN2, IN3, and IN4 control the modules from the left to the right. And then you will need the VCC plugged into your Arduino 5 volt control er, supply. On the four on the module there is three open ports. The center, I'm going to start from the left. The left is the normally open port that will only turn on when the module is turned to low. The center port is called the common connector. This is the one that you're going to want to supply your power to as the mo relays work like light switches. So this will be where the power is supplied to, the center. And then the right is called the normally closed. And whenever your module is turned to true, this one will be outputting the power. So during this project we will use the normally closed and the common connection. The first step will be to allow your circuit to be controlled by your Arduino. So what we will want to do is plug in the 5 volts and due to the circuit design we're going to be plugging it into a breadboard and from that breadboard in the same row we are going to output the power the 5 volts to the VCC on the 4 relay module. Then we're going to take our ground pin from the Arduino and put it to the ground on the 4 relay module. Then for this project we will be controlling the first relay using the 7 pin on the Arduino to IN1 so that way we can tr control the first relay. Now to enable power to the module, we are going to run a 5 volt connection from the breadboard to the common port of the 4 relay module. So we will put that in the center and tighten it down with a screwdriver. Then we are going to want to get an additional cable and plug it into the motor. So we're going to use the normally open port and tighten that down. And plug it to the positive side of the motor. Then our motor needs a ground so I will be plugging the ground from the motor to the ground on the Arduino board. Now that we have our relay connected, we will upload our program to the Arduino and pump the water. And this circuit will slowly pump out the water from one cup to the other cup. Which allows us to do many things, from setting up a garden to creating a fish filter. And just like that, the water was sucked out from one cup to the next cup. And now I'm going to disconnect the motor so that way it stops pumping the water. 